Prison escapes usually are one hell of a thing to execute successfully. However, at times, luck sides with the prisoner, and they are given a clear ramp to running away. In this video, we're going to talk about five criminal prison escapes executed by criminals in the most unbelievable way. Let's get started. Number 5. Benton County, Washington In the Benton County of Washington State, a court session took place where this prisoner was found guilty of his allegations and was taken back to jail. However, what happened next is truly unimaginable. This man, standing in the doorway, waits for everyone to get in, and that's when he decides to make a run for it. It can be seen in the CCTV footage that the prisoner enters the courtroom again and leaves from the other end through a door. But you might be wondering if someone would catch him in the building. Well, no. Because this person has a solution. To bewitch the guards, he takes off his shirt to hide the handcuffs during his run and takes off his orange prisoner shoes deciding to run barefoot in an attempt to fool the guards. Rightfully so, he made it out successfully. But then, the authorities had to come into action, and within hours, he was found at his friend's house. Number 4. Jefferson County Circuit Court This occurrence is of when a 29-year-old Brayton Woodford was accused of violating the sentence of probation for drugs and weapon charges and can be seen charged to serve five years behind bars. As the sentence is read, his girlfriend from behind can be heard screaming and crying. What happens next is just absurd. While the judge is taking testimony from the detective, the camera controlled by the judge is left on that detective's empty chair. And that's how Woodford's escape attempt is recorded, as he tries to run across the room and out. However, to his utter dismay, he is confronted by the deputies and brought back inside the room, making his escape attempt end in a fiasco. Number 3. Lewis County Courthouse Within this courtroom to the right can be seen four defendants. This one is Jacob Tanner, who is charged with reckless driving and driving with a suspended license. Whereas this guy is Cody Howard, who is charged with second-degree burglary, first-degree trafficking in stolen property, third-degree driving with a suspended license, along with failure to appear in court. As the session appears to have been over, these two seek more trouble as they decide to make a run and go outside the courtroom. The judge can be seen making a run after them, too. The duo is caught in multiple CCTV footages which shows that they take the stairs to make it to the ground floor. However, as they are about to escape through the door, one of the defendants, who kind of lagged when his shoe slipped off, is caught, while the deputies recover the other just a few blocks away. Not just did their escape plan fail by the barest of margins, but they also got charged with second degree escape and had to deal with their wrongdoings. Number 2. Fayette County Justice Center This story is of the man Ronald Neal, who can be seen appearing before the judge in the footage. He's charged with theft and fleeing officers, and that's exactly the reason he is in court to deal with the legalities. However, the situation twists when it's revealed that Ronald had to appear yesterday, which he didn't, and hence his warrant of arrest is issued after which he's taken by the officers. But he decides to test the security as he makes an escape run. Ronald can be seen dodging the officer to make a run out of the building. On his way to the exit, he had damaged the court door, injured the officer, and did what he could to make it successfully out of the building. However, the poor lad was caught and later brought back to the courtroom. But things didn't end there, he was then further charged with escape, damage to a government building, and injuring officials, which added another five years to his prison sentence, and he is now behind bars to serve a total of 10 years. Number 1. Davidson County Juvenile Court 
These four youngsters who were awaiting their trials for armed robbery, auto theft, and murder decided to take a risk and make a run out of the building in the night. The boys can be seen making a run up the stairs in an attempt to escape. However, as the footage suggests, the escape seemed too easy to be true, as there's no one present to stop them, which makes the situation sound dubious. However, as far as the boys are concerned, they did make a run, but to their dismay, they are later caught and had to face additional charges. The reason behind their easy escape was later uncovered. It turns out the two employees were involved in facilitating their escape. But don't worry, they too were terminated and then arrested for their disgusting crime. And that's how the video comes to an end. I hope you enjoyed watching it and found it interesting. If you did, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon to stay updated. We'll see you in another video. Until then, watch these two videos on your screen.